Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Don Franco and I am for Don Franco Solution. You are welcome to our channel. Today we are going to be talking about the second part of the 20 signs that shows that he may not love you in the relationship. We hope that you did. For those of you who watched the first part, enjoy the content. And uh, please, whenever you pass around, don't forget to like our videos. Don't forget to subscribe. And don't also forget to hit the notification bell so that whenever we upload a new video, you'll be the first to be notified. And for those who did not watch the first part of this video, we are going to put it on the top part of this channel so that you can watch it immediately after you finish this part. Remember, Don Franco is here to bring you so many tips concerning your relationships, your marriages, and your family. Thank you. Please do stay around. Sign number 11. They don't support your goals and your dreams. Remember, before you meet anyone in life, you've got goals, you've got dreams. How many of your goals and your, and your dreams are you working on right now with your boyfriend? No? I guess? One? No. Look, if you are in a relationship with someone and he doesn't try to work with you on your goals and dreams, and he thinks that your goals are not realizable or he thinks that your dreams are not a dream of a girl that he want to get married to or he just want to totally twist or change all your dreams and goals and take you to the direction that he thinks is right for you you gotta be careful because matter of fact if somebody loves you he's gonna actually love your dream in most cases they will even nurture the dream for you they will help you achieve your dreams and your goals because it doesn't change anything. A dream is a passion. And if you're in a relationship with a guy who doesn't see anything good in your dreams and your passions and your goals, just know that he's gonna take you to a path that's gonna be very difficult for you should in case you guys separate together. Because a relationship is never sure. Even a marriage is not sure. So you better stick to your dream and look for a guy who is gonna actually love you for your goals, love you for your dreams, help you to nurture your dreams and your goals so that you will just have the best out of you in your relationship. So if this dude or this boy that you so much cherish and love does not support your dreams and your goals, then there's some, some, something actually missing in the puzzle. You might want to know why. And one of the most reasons, one of the liable reasons that would make him not to be considerate on your dreams and your goals may, that, may be that he doesn't love you that much or he does not just love you anymore. Sign number 12. They don't make efforts to resolve trust issues in your relationship. Let's put it this way. You are in a relationship with him. His activities are kind of fishy. You have trust issues with him because he doesn't give you the reason to trust him. Now, it's time you bring up a case. He doesn't want to do any effort to give you more credit in order for you to trust him, to make sure that you can trust him. He always sweeps everything beneath the table. You gotta be careful in this kind of relationship because if a dude loves you, he will want to do everything for you to trust him because when there is trust in a relationship, it is actually healthy. When there is no trust, your relationship is not going to be certain because there is going to be so much uncertainties and insecurities on your part. So if you're in a relationship with somebody and he doesn't try to try as much as help you solve the trust issues that you have for them, and he just give and he just give flimsy excuses when you maybe suspect him chatting with somebody on the phone and. Uh, you think that that might be another woman, he does not even try to explain or do anything closer to that, 
and he just want to keep you in that environment. Girls, you should be thinking much deeper because this guy might not just be the kind of Prince Charming that you fell in love with or that you think loves you. This is a very important sign that you need to consider it. Sign number 13, when they don't apologize or show remorse after hurting you. I think this one should just be the height of it. Yeah, if you are in a relationship with someone, they don't apologize when they hurt you. When they hurt you, they want to force you, they want to compel you to apologize for the meanwhile they are the ones that hurt you. They don't feel even remorseful. You don't see them having some regret in their mind about what they did to you. This is one very much important sign for you to know that he doesn't even love you or care about your feelings. Because there's one thing not to love someone and there's another thing to actually care about how they feel. It's just being human. Like if he doesn't love you, he should at least care. I mean, when he hurts you, he should at least apologize or feel remorseful. If he hurts you and he is your boyfriend, he does, he's not apologetic and he is not remorseful. Then he doesn't love you and he's not even sympathetic. Like just a normal human being when they hurt somebody. I think if you see this kind of sign in a relationship, you gotta take time and you just have to pick your things and leave before he crushes you because even the day he kills you, he will still not feel apologetic. He will still not feel remorseful. This sign is very, very important. When you are in a relationship with a guy who doesn't feel apologetic, he doesn't apologize, he doesn't feel remorseful when he hurts you. You just have to be very be careful. Sign number 15. Sign number 15. I'm so excited about sign number 15. And uh, what is it about? Sign number 15. When you are the only one that usually say, I love you. And they are the ones who say, I love you too. If you are in this kind of situation where you always repeat your word and say it too, then you should know that he left. You are the only one in this relationship. In fact, the both of you are sharing your love. You, he is just, in, he is just, I, I want to say, complimenting part of the love that you have for him. He doesn't have nothing for you. Like, oh, I love you, baby. And he's like, I love you too. In the morning, at night, a oh, good night, baby. I love you. He said, I love you too. Tomorrow, I love you, baby. I love you too. Ah! If you are in this kind of situation. Take off your shoes and run. You are the only one left in the relationship he traveled. He doesn't love you anymore. Because if someone loves you, this reflex, I love you, will always come up. If you are the one who is producing and he's just responding the chorus of I love you too, girl, you love him, but he doesn't love you too. He's just playing your game because he doesn't know how else he can tell you like, you know what, I don't love you. So you got to pick very, very, uh, 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 you're going to take this point very, very importantly because some of us, when we fall in love, we close our eyes, we block our ears, we don't see, we don't hear, we're just so happy that we love someone. I would not have the time to listen to the echoes whether he has the same love that we do. Point number, point number 16. When they don't make any effort to show any physical intimacy around you when they are with you, you know? Come in to touch you, make compliments, hug you, hold hands with you, play around with you, carry you when you're on the street with them, try to play, try to... To, to do crazy things, try to, to, to remove your shoes and run with. Just be physically intimate with you. At home, on the street, or anywhere else that you guys can find yourself. If he doesn't do any of that, if he doesn't show any intimacy on the outside world with you, 
and he just wanna have you in his bed. You gotta consider that this day doesn't love you. You know, when a guy loves you, he wanna touch your hair when you're moving, he wanna hug you, he wanna hold you side by side with him when he's moving in the street, he wanna hold your hands, he wanna touch you in any part of your body that he wants and run. He wanna play hide and seek with you. Doesn't matter the age. When somebody actually loves you, he becomes kid. He becomes a kid for you. He loves you and he does everything to make you feel happy. But if you're having, if you're going on the street with him and he's just on the phone, he doesn't even look at you, he crosses, crosses the road only on the phone, he doesn't even know on which direction you are walking at, then you gotta think very deeply because this might just be one of the glaring signs that he doesn't love you anymore. Sign number 17, when they do not show any appreciations for the effort that you are doing in your relationship to grow. For example, we have these kind of situations where when a girl falls in love with a boy, she goes to the boy's house, cleans up the house, make it beautiful, buy some curtains and decorate the house, make the house habitable, you know, like some girls have, some boys' houses are eh, some kind of, you know. Yeah, but when a girl meets them and when a girl falls in love with them, they, they just want to clean, make everything, buy some stuff, go put and set the house in a nice way. Some guys don't even appreciate you for that. Whatever thing you do for a relationship, they don't appreciate, they just feel like, oh, it's your right to do it by the way. But if you have this kind of relationship, where whatever thing you do, this dude doesn't actually appreciate you for whatever thing you do. You gotta be careful. You gotta think twice. He might just be taking you like, okay, yeah, so what? Let her do whatever things you wanna do. It doesn't make any difference. If she doesn't want me, when she walks away, I'm gonna get another girl. To be honest, if a dude likes you, if a dude loves you, every little thing, even the food you cook for him, he's gonna appreciate it. He's gonna make you feel so special. Every little thing you do to him, talking of cleaning up his shit, his house, everything like that, everything that you do, he is gonna appreciate. If he's not appreciative of the effort you put in, in your relationship, and he's not putting any effort, any effort, on the other side, you gotta just start thinking, this might just be one of the signs that show that he doesn't love you, all right? Skip, stop, stop trying to prove a point. Stop being his slave. Stop trying so hard to show that you love him. If he loves you back, you don't need to so much work harder for the relationship you want. Sign number 18 when they don't try at all to understand your perspective. Whenever you are in an argument with them, they will always be the one to win. They don't want to see from which angle you're coming from. They will always be the one to dominate the argument. They think that you don't have any opinion. They don't want to understand your perspective because they think you don't have any perspective. This might just be because, this might just be because this guy doesn't really love you you know you see when a guy loves you everything that you say he will try to find out or he'll try to did you something good for me doesn't matter what you said doesn't matter whether you're intelligent or not doesn't matter whether you went to school or not and he's so intelligent whatever thing you say he'll try to find out from what perspective you're coming from in order to balance discussion between the two of you but if he always shuns that at you, whatever thing you say, he doesn't consider it. He doesn't want to listen to it. Whatever thing you say, he doesn't consider it. He thinks that you don't have a perspective or, what, or something like that. You should know that this dude normally doesn't love you. And you got to be very, very careful. He doesn't love you anymore. Yeah, I think. Well, it, it depends, actually. Sometimes it, it might just be a character of somebody. It doesn't matter. But in most cases, when a guy loves you, he gives himself some, he gives himself some patience to understand your perspective. If he doesn't do that, whatever thing that you say, he thinks that you are saying rubbish, then you gotta think again. He might not love you, as he pretends to say. Or he might just be that kind of dude who doesn't think other people have opinions which is at the same time not good for you in a relationship. Sign number 19. 
when they don't create time for you or better still when they are ready to choose their friends over you for example when you're in a relationship with a guy you know everybody like works in, uh, uh, in this our days everybody goes to work and all that whenever he's on his free time he just want to go play with his friends he doesn't want to play with you he's even ready to choose his friends over you man if you have this kind of relationship you might want to think deeper if actually this person loves you why would he not want to be with you you know if you want to choose his friends over you then there's there definitely something or oh, just want to play phone the phone games yeah you see like they will tell you no it's my hobby my hobby is to play phone games my hobby is to play computer games all those kind of explanations like that if you see that in his free time he just want to hang on to his hobbies play computer games all day play phone games all day just eat or just comes around you when he want to satisfy his personal needs or just want to go out with friends he doesn't want to really have time for you then I think he doesn't love you or he, he just think like what are we going to talk about he doesn't love you remember before somebody actually shows that they love you they need to give you time they need to be with you they need to be with you all the time or at least when they are free yeah if they don't show this kind of affection time affection they want to be close to you they just want to distract themselves with the hobbies or go play with friends you gotta think twice they may not be in love with you anymore or they may not have even ever fallen in love with you you know there are so many selfish reasons where guys will hold on to in a relationship not actually because and the sign number 20 sign number 20 when they don't say I love you when they start removing their eye in I love you and they always say love you love you you gotta start thinking twice they may not love you anymore you know why because the I is very 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 important in your relationship that is the only word that he expresses from his heart I love you it's different from love you love you love you love you that might just be a line of a poem but when he says from the heart he will sound out the I love you baby I love you princess I love you this I love you that if he doesn't say I love you to you quite often you got to try and find out why he doesn't say that he might just be fulfilling just kind of a formality in a relationship I said love you yeah you know these are some of the signs that you would want to consider to check whether this dude or this guy loves you anymore or not however however it is very very important to note that every relationship is different relationships are not the same and it doesn't mean that whatever thing we've said in this video are just hundred percent right or wrong it's just our opinion and we also think that whatever the, the difficulties you are going through in your, your relationship what the, what, whatever the hitches that you are going through sometimes it's worth it trying to negotiate a dialogue with your partner to try to see how you can solve these problems and live a better life we are so happy to have shared this 20 signs that show that you may not be loved anymore by your boyfriend and if you like this video and you have some more signs please kindly put it in the comment section below so that we can read and why not try to build up another video for you in the future thank you for watching our video we hope you do like it please don't forget to like and hit the notification bell for other videos whenever we upload a new, a new video you are gonna be notified thank you for staying around with don franco's solution